a huge honor to have Rabbi Pinchas Horowitz. He's a rabbi here of Heichel Yerushalayim. Here in Ramat, a very great spa the yeshiva here for English speakers, to share an amazing Shabbat message for Am Yisrael. Hello, everybody. Have a good Shabbos. Something that you could share. Something, a beautiful concept that really gave me a lot of strength when I first learned this and, and dwelled on it. We find in this week's Parsha the burial of Sari Menu, our great mother, great great grandmother, Sarah. Sarah, she was buried. And there's a whole discussion about her burial, about the way that she was, Avram purchased a very special plot for the burial. Interesting, the, this episode connects back to the previous Parsha as well. Last thing we, we left off with last week in the previous Parsha was the Akedas Yitzchak, the great sacrifice that Avram went to sacrifice his own son, Yitzchak, Isaac, up on the mountain, and Rosh Hashem, he survived. The Midrash says something fascinating. It says that he survived, but he didn't. It says that actually, as Avram's knife went, even though the body wasn't touched by the knife, but the soul of Yitzchak itself left the body, and the body died. At that moment, Hashem made a miracle, and Yitzchak was brought back to life. The soul re-entered the body, and Yitzchak, Isaac himself, stood up and said, Baruch Atah Hashem, Mechayei Amesim. Blessed are you, God, the one who revives the dead. And he said, from here we see there's going to be an eventual revival of the dead that's going to happen to the world. What is, how does this episode of Yitzchak reconnect to Sari Menu's death and burial? We know something, something special. Why bury a body? It's empty, it's gone. It's, you know, it's not living anymore. No, we honor the body. We honor the dead. There's something special about the body of a person, the body of a Jew. There's something special that deserves special honor. Why? Because there's something intrinsic about that body of a person, of a holy person, that it itself is something fitting to come back to life. It's something eternal. The Jewish body, the holy soul, <clears throat> leaves its mark in the Jewish body. It's something that needs a special honor. You don't bury, bury a, a mouse that you catch or a plant that withers away and dies. We bury a human body, a Jewish body. Why? Because just like Yitzchak itself in last week's par Parsha, his body left and the soul came back in and he came back to life and he realized there's going to be something special. The Kedusha of the body never leaves. So too, Sari Menu, we bury her, we honor her, we glorify her with a special grave in this week's Parsha to show the eternity of even the Jewish body is holy. Amen. Have a good